Hey, what do you do in order to stay healthy or to relax? Like what gives you a break from the craziness around you? There are so many different things you can do in the Springfield, Missouri area to help you with this. And we want to focus on giving you some ideas as well. Shoot, I probably need some help because I'm always like, go, 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 go and kind of stressed. So I'm really excited to dig into this. Let's go, I'm excited. Hey, my name is Jesse Weiser and I'm a local realtor here from Springfield, Missouri area. And here are a few self-care places in the Springfield area. We want to cover it all for you today. Places to exercise, where you can get your hair or nails done, some other options or any activities that you can help get rid of stress. We even found things you'll find are a bit out there, but we have quite the list for you today and remember if you're wanting to reach out just to chat or ask questions about real estate or moving here please do so you're gonna get me how exciting is that we also have our facebook page or you can simply text us at the number below it will be put in the description as well i really want to connect with you seriously reach out so now let's move on with it there is so much to touch up on usually in springfield there's a gym and salon on every corner so we found some places that are the best of the best we will begin with the one that we found the most obvious which is gyms in the area there are a lot of gyms that we have here that are nationwide you will easily recognize names like genesis planet fitness and the ymcas they are all really popular and there are at least two or three in the springfield area most of them have an exercise room and a few classes you can attend as well i think the ymca has a pool Faith likes Planet Fitness because of the price of the membership, while Chelsea loves Genesis because they have childcare. Hey now, I know some of you need that out there, so get with it. You can like them for any reason though, based on your preferences. Me, what kind of gym do I like? Well, I like the lunch room, that's what I like. <laughs> we also have a few other gyms that we could point out as being a favorite to the area. There's 10 Fitness, Royal Barbell Club, and Anytime Fitness. Now these aren't necessarily local gyms, but they still aren't ones most people have heard of. And these all come very highly rated. They come with weightlifting areas, cardio machines, and at least a few other like classes to take. It all depends on your preference and the location near you. Now let's talk about family centers that generally come with pools, playgrounds, exercise areas, classes, and other things like that. You have the Doling Family Center, the Chesterfield Family Center, and another called Dane Candy Family Center. All three of these family centers are owned by the city of Springfield, and if you're a member, you have access to all three centers. And the good thing about it is that they're in three different areas of Springfield, so you can just choose them based on where you live. They have a lot of events for kids to keep them active, and they have the gyms there for the adults. This is another that has different amenities based on which location you choose. The Doling Center on the north side has a park and a swimming center. Dan Kenny is known for the best center for the gym, and the Chesterfield location is known for, well, well, I've, I've never been there, so I, I couldn't really tell you what they're known for, but they are all good in their unique little way. Well, let me tell you, Faith just told me that they are known for their pool. They got slides everywhere and just, just cool stuff. You, you really need to check it out. Now, there are a few places to exercise that are done in a classroom setting. You have ones like Orange Theory, Cycle Bar, and CrossFit. Now, I don't know that much about these places, but I know that they focus primarily on aerobics and they all kind of have their own little thing. With Orange Theory, you have a heart monitor that keeps you in the orange level to working out. Cycle Bar involves a lot of cycling during their classes, and CrossFit is a thing that many people rave about. You also have some people that feel this way or that way about it. Never mind that. If you like CrossFit, we have three locations in Springfield that you can go to. I don't know why I'm talking intense, but CrossFit makes me intense for some reason. They are all different and bring different benefits to choose from. These are just known to be some of the best. This is one I always forget about until someone reminds me. Hot yoga. Nope, it's not just regular boring old yoga. It's the one that you do in a really hot room and sweat like you've never done before. I don't know who in the world would want to do this, but for some reason, people like it. Now, I've read into some of the advantages and it's pretty cool. I don't know if I want to admit this, but whatever, it's cool. 
Now you can find a couple places at like Sumit Hot Yoga, My Hot Yoga, Pure Hot Yoga, Sweat Hot Yoga and Fitness. Now let's get into something that I know you ladies are going to love. If you didn't love hot yoga, you're gonna love this, right? <laughs> We looked up some of the most favorite salons and spas in the Springfield area and found the best to be Grove Spa, Studio 417 Salon, Deluxe Nails and Spa, Lucky Nails, Glam Boutique Nails and Spa, and Aqua Nails and Spa. Whew. That was quite the list there. Other fantastically rated ones that aren't as popular are New Essence Spa, Ideal Image, Acacia, and Elegant Nail Salon. This is one of those subjects that there are so many of them. We ultimately chose them by how popular they were and they're all over four and a half out of five star reviews. Wow. Each of these places has its own look, taste, and you can all find something you love about each one. Now, 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 even from time to time, I'll even go to the salon. You never have to cut your own toenails again. Can I, am I right? Am I, can I say that? And you know she's going to love going with you. Really, you can't go wrong with any of these places. We also noticed a few salons being a place to go get your hair cut. The big one we found is called Studio 417 as one of the most popular in the Springfield area. Then you have ones like the Cutting Edge, Karma Salon, Indie Blue Salon, Mojo Pie Salon, and Art Gallery. This one looks to be a lot of fun. Innovation Salon, David Wenzel Salon, Valeria Boss Salon, and Blue Sky Salon. There's so many salons. Some of these places have some awesome interior and give you a good break in the afternoon. For the fellas out there, I would recommend the Walnut Street Barbershop, which is a classic, or Hudson Hawk, which you will see all over town. It's actually a big deal around here. Another great one is Rogue Barbershop, which is kind of downtown as well. I kind of threw that in there, so I like okay. threw my own little barbershop in there. Now, have you heard of Halo Therapy? I didn't either before this. This is something that's salt breathing therapy. It's the craziest thing. You can go into what's called a salt vault, where you sit and breathe the air. It's supposed to help with respiratory concerns the more you go. You can find this at Breathe Health Spa. This is also another weird one, sensory deprivation. You can go inside a tank where the water pushes you up and you float, taking away some of your sensations over time. We have a spa for that at Theta Float Spa. It helps to relieve stress and is unlike anything I've ever heard before. Wow. We also had a lot of people mention that being able to do a class is a good way to grow as a person, learn a new skill. This is one thing that no matter how old you are, you're never too late to get involved with a new project and make something special. But guess what? We've already made a video like this. I'm going to go ahead and put it up here, just right here, check it out. We've got some of our favorites like classes at the Finley Farm, Firehouse Pottery, AR Workshop, all of our favorites just right there above. Now for those of you that just want to walk around someplace nice, we have some phenomenal parks in Springfield. Some of the most beautiful ones that you can find are at Sequiota Park, Nathaniel Green Park and the Botanical Gardens, the Japanese Stroll Garden that's right next to Nathaniel Green, and the Springfield Nature Center. And I know this might be a surprise, but we also have a video for this one too. Look for it right up here. Check it out. <laughs> you might say this is a walk in the park because it's very much a walk in the park. I was gonna say a joke there, but there isn't really a joke there because you're walking in the park. Now we went through these pretty dang quickly, but there was so much more that we found. If there is a place you wanna shout out below, let us know about it in the comments section. We tried to find them based on Google reviews. That way you're getting to the heart of the Springfieldians directly. All right, that's our spiel for today. If you could smash that like button for us, it's supposed to help with the YouTube algorithm and would mean the world to me. I hope this video made you want to throw some cucumbers on your eyes and relax. Anyways, love you guys. Have a good one.